Hey folks, Mike and McGee here. In today's video, this is what you've been waiting for. We put clover in this field when we originally worked it up and it has come up pretty good. I'm pretty happy. Now I wouldn't mind if it was a little thicker, but this is pretty good. In this experiment, I'm going to plant the corn directly through the clover. Now this stuff here, as it plants, it does cut a furrow, plant it, and then cover it back over. So the clover is not going to be there around those seeds competing as it comes up. Hopefully as this field progresses, it'll all cover and we'll have a good thick crop of clover under and amongst the corn. That's our hope, but there's a few weeds coming up. I'm not sure how it's going to go. This is a strictly a test to see how it's going to go when it be different in every field. Every field has a different weed density. I know last year we battled cucklebur something fierce. We pulled them and pulled them and pulled them. So I'm hoping that seed bank is fairly used up, but you probably know as well as I do, that's probably not the case. Morning glory is something we've got bad out here. So we're just going to have to see how it goes. I know even when I cultivate, the morning glory comes up and runs the vines. So probably not going to get away from that. The project right now is to get this corn in the ground. And in order to keep from just driving too much and destroying a lot of this clover, I'm going to drive around the field, go down the driveway, and then I'm going to plant this way. Then I'm going to drive back around again just to keep from having too much turnaround because down there at that end of the field, I don't have a whole lot of space. So it's going to work better to do that anyway. Let's get on with it. I'm going to plant yellow corn on this side, white corn on that side. Let's do it. You got you, son. No, he ain't
All right, we got her planted. Still got even a little bit of shade in the field. Flying by the seat of your pants like this creates issues and you have to watch as you go and make sure everything's going to work. What I realized as I'm planting this, I am probably killing half of my clover that I've got out here. You are mulching. It doesn't matter if it's wood chips, hay, leaves, whatever it is, plastic. You can't halfway mulch and expect to do a good job. You gotta be all in or all out. And I wanna be all in. So what I'm gonna do this evening when it gets a little cooler, I'm gonna get another 150 pound of clover seed out here and I'm gonna spread it because tomorrow and the next day is supposed to rain. That would work out perfect. I don't wanna do it right now because the ground is fairly wet and the sun is fairly hot and it might work against me. And besides that, we've got hay down we're going to go pick up some hay. That'll be in a different video. But this evening, I'm going to come out here and sow this with clover again right over the whole field. And then I'll feel like I'm all in. So we've got this corn planted. It was wonderful to have a corn planter. My old buddy Heath in California plants thousands, a couple thousand acres, maybe 1,200 acres of corn. And he was happy to see that I got a corn planter as well. I'm sure a lot of you that feel sorry for how hard my poor boys have to work push planting every year. And the boys probably agree. So we've got it going on. Let's get this clover planted this evening and I'll wrap up this video. All right, we got it re-sowed down. We planted another 100 pounds of clover on here. Now you might think I am crazy as a loon. That is a total of 250 pounds of clover seed on this patch, which I'm considering to be roughly an acre. I've got one shot to make this mulch count. I've got to get it in, got to get it thick because I want you to see what really happens when it's done as well as can be expected. Am I taking a risk? Yes, I'm taking a risk. Is that any reason for you to be upset? No, it's not. So <laughs> stick with us. We're going to see if this thing works. Personal opinion, if we have a dry spell, I may still be okay because this thing will work together. I've had it work in the past. Let's see if it works this time. You guys have a great day. We'll see you on the next video.